Hi, I'm Michael Tejedor, and right now we're in BI Labs. Uh, and a hot topic nowadays is analytics. A lot of people are talking about analytics, talking about data mining, how can we get more insight into the data we have. So we have some internal projects where we actually take a look at this in a lot of detail. And with me, I have Raman Nair. And Raman? Hi, uh, I'm Raman Ayer. I'm the development manager for the SQL Server Analysis Services Engine team. Uh, the Analysis Services Engine is uh, the core of the Microsoft BI platform. Uh, it's, the, it's the thing that uh, drives and powers the uh, OLAP, data mining, and power pivot experiences that we offer. And this particular BI Lab project that we're putting up on BI Labs, what is that all about? What we're um, trying to show you here is, is a little bit of a glimpse into easily accessible and powerful data mining services in the cloud uh, that leverage the data mining capabilities that we've already shipped with SQL Server Analysis Services. Um, our vision with SQL Server Data Mining has always been to take this um, exotic technology uh, that you typically associate with uh, PhD, mad professor type of folks, uh, and bring that to everyone, to regular developers, to marketing folks, Excel users, uh, and we think this is this is going to be a good step in that direction. Okay. So, what are some of the benefits uh, as users of the products that they can experience through the project? Sure. Um, the key thing I think is that uh, people have been hearing a lot about data mining and predictive analytics. It's hot, but they're also nervous because they think it's really complicated. And our goal is to make it really simple. Right, so the, the biggest benefit is that you don't need to install any services, uh, you don't need to go off and, config, and configure a lot of things. Um, you just either go to a web app where you don't need to install anything, you just bring up your browser uh, and boom, you're there and you're getting analysis out of it. Um, or you download and install an Excel add-in um, and then you go, go about doing this kind of analysis inside uh, of Excel without needing to install anything else. So I, I actually installed the, the uh, Excel add-in version of this. And uh, I've got to tell you, it's so easy to use. You, I had about 100 rows of data. Uh, and the add-in actually shows up on the toolbar. And then you have your different functions that you can perform on the data. And it'll just send that out into the cloud, I guess, in, in the system you've set up. And then returns, and it doesn't take any time at all, returns this right. result set um, and, and actually provides you a lot of insight on the data. Do you have some real-world examples of how people are using this type of functionality? Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, a scenario that I really like to um, show off to people is, um, you know, getting information about your customers, learning more about your customers. So let's say you have customer data, uh, visitors to a certain store, um, and you have uh, demographic information like their age, marital status, uh, how many cars they own, how many kids they have, and whether they bought a certain product or not. And one of these services will take this data and give you back a report that tells you what are the key factors that influence in rank order um, whether they bought this product or not, which is really, really useful for you. You could drive so many things off of it. You could do targeted mailing. You could mm. drive your inventory management off of it. You could figure out what other products these people might be interested in. It just gives you so much insight. and and the cool thing is that you don't really need to understand anything about the data mining technology itself. There's a lot of complex machine learning algorithms working under the scenes to give you this insight, but you as an end user or even a developer don't need to understand how this technology works to use it. If you're a developer, you can go off and embed uh, these services in your web application transparently. You just make a few calls and you get back this report, and you can format it and publish it however you want. And you don't have to do any of this crunching, any of this machine learning. Excellent. So it's essentially, just a, it really simplifies and allows you to get a lot more insight out of the data you already have to do more targeted uh, activities uh, across your business. Absolutely. I love it. And it is so easy to use. Um, so in terms of uh, an ask from our, our audience, is there any particular feedback that you'd like to know uh, on how they're using the project or any more uh, insight you'd like to get from our audience around this? Right, sure. Yeah, we're, we built this whole thing based on you know, looking at what customers want, what are their pain points, and what we want people to do is, if you're using these three components, if you're a developer 
and you're using these web services and embedding them, we want to know what kind of apps you're building, whether you're building thin client apps uh, in, in the cloud or rich client apps, and what kind of apps these are that you're building. That's going to really tell us what else we should be putting up there in the cloud to meet your needs. And if you're an end user, do you like these tasks? Are you getting value out of uh, these uh, services that we put up there uh, through the Excel add-in or through our web front end? And what else you'd like us to put up there? What's missing? Great. Well, thank you. thanks, Raman, for spending time with us. And if you're looking for the project, it is up on BI Labs, and we're going to call it um, Data Mining in the Cloud, I think. Yep. All Enjoy. Right.